how to get free subdomain. So all that you have to do is simply put in the preferred name that you want to be as your subdomain, just like this one, and that is it. So when you come here to GoDaddy, and then you come and then search for a custom domain, okay? So this is a custom domain, a .com domain, and it is currently at $15,750 thousand dollars for a premium domain and that is why you need a subdomain so let me show you how to get a subdomain simply go to google and then from google search come and then type in buy t.host and hit enter it's going to bring you right here to their platform and all that you have to do is simply come here to the free hosting and come and select free hosting plan so when you click on it you can come and then get a free hosting all that you have to do is simply scroll to the button and come here to where we have sign up for a plan and come and click on it so when you click on it you can simply sign up for your free hosting plan and all that you have to do is simply come and then put in your subdomain name okay the name that you prefer to be your subdomain you create a password you put in your email address so after putting your email address simply come here to where we have the site category okay and then come and then click on the arrow and then come and then select personal okay and then after that simply come to the site language to and come and then select english okay so after doing that all that you have to do is simply come here to where we have the security code okay this one the one that you see simply come and then enter it right here into this box just like this one okay and after that all that you have to do is simply come and then click on the register okay so I'm simply going to pick a subdomain name as blogging tools just like this one and then after that all that you have to do is simply click on the register and all that I have to do now is to simply activate my account they have sent me a confirmation mail in my email and if you go and then the mail didn't come simply come and then click on this link and they are going to resend it so let's go right into your mail so from your inbox you might not see it simply come here to the more and then from the more simply come here to where we have the spam folder and come and click on it it is not a spam okay so all that you have to do is simply come here to the hosting activation and come and click on it so when you click on it you are going to see that thank you for registering with them as you can see it's right here all that you have to do is simply come and then click on this link and when you click on it this is going to pop up that is all you need okay so that is your control panel username you can highlight it and copy it down and then you have your control panel url and then beside that one too you also have your website url as well okay so let's click on the website url and as you can see congratulations you have successfully created your account and you can log in directly to your c panel and then upload your website okay so let's go there so let's come and then click on the c panel url and over here you have to come and then put in the username here the one that you highlighted and copy it come and then paste it right here come and then put in your password the one you created and come and click on log in after that over here simply come and then click on i approve and when you click on you approve you are going to be taken directly to your control panel just like this one over here scroll down and then come here to where we have the subtitles app installer and come and click on it and there you see that you have wordpress and you can install it on your free subdomain like the video and then see you in my next video